It's the flag off of the distribution of the multi-million Naira instructional materials and shuttle buses to schools across Anambra State. And the headquarters of the State Universal Basic Education Board, Asubeb, comes alive with the presence of teachers, students and pupils who are the beneficiaries. The items to be distributed include ICT equipment, textbooks for English, mathematics and other core subjects, magnetic whiteboards, early childhood care and development apparatus, chairs and tables for GSS classes, iron-framed tables for teachers, and six shuttle buses for quality assurance, monitoring and supervision visits. The executive chairman of Asubeb, Dr. Vera Mwadinobi, commends Governor Saludo for his unwavering interest in promoting education. She says the procurement of the instructional materials was made possible through the payment of over 3 billion Naira matching grant to UBEC slash Subex 2019, 2020 and 2021 intervention projects to improve the teaching and learning environment of the public schools. Immediately we assumed office as a board when he inaugurated us. We took it upon ourselves to, you know, to be reminding him that there is a backlog of counterpart fund. Because this counterpart fund helps in school renovation, helps in providing new school structures where it is not uh, enough. The head of service, Mrs. Theodora Igwegwe, speaks on behalf of Governor Soludo and notes that this administration ends the era of schools without teachers. It is not just a matter of employing teachers. He has employed 5,000 teachers and the process of employing another 3,000 is ongoing. But apart from that, there is improvement in every sphere of education. If for nothing else, if we look around here today, Everybody will agree with me that what he has given to Asubeb in order for the job of Asubeb to progress and for our children to benefit is not something that you can just sweep under the carpet. The Holy Spirit. The items are then flagged off and handed over. ECCD table and chair, 100 sets of ECCD tables and chairs. Some of the pupils sit on the new chairs to get a feel of what their experience will be going forward. Especially these instructional materials, at least it will help us with the teachers and the students and the pupils for learning and teaching effectively in the classroom. However, the school authorities are reminded to protect the items in order to serve the purpose for which they have been provided.